Hello and welcome to my kitchen. Uh, today, egg liqueur. Uh, yeah, that's some uh, something for a uh, winter time, which is coming. Christmas be soon. Whatever. Uh, I'm gonna make today, and I'm gonna show you how to do egg liqueur called Advocate, Advocate, whatever. Uh, I will make the egg liqueur because the Advocate. Advocate, advocate, I don't know, just correct me, uh, is based on uh, brandy. And I'll make mine based on vodka. I'm not doing the liquor to drink at the moment because I intend to use it as a filling for my fill, uh, alcohol filled chocolates, which I'm going to show you, which I'm going to show you uh, in the next film. But if you do that and increase some uh, amount of vodka and of condensed milk, that's not the condensed, it's evaporated uh, because it contains no sugar, you'll have the, the drink, the liqueur you can um, offer to your guests, you can take with you to, to the party. Um, yeah, that's something delicious, that's something almost organic because I'll use the organic yolks from the eggs. I don't know if that will be visible. The more yellow the eggs are, the yolks are, the better. But it doesn't really affect the taste, even if they're really pale, it doesn't matter. Uh, just, just the yolks. I've got... Uh, it, it, it just uh, at the beginning I have to tell you that this machine is pretty noisy so I'll tell you roughly what I'm doing and then uh, I'll try to explain during the, the work working that together uh, what I'm doing so I've got the eight, yol eight yolks which are separated from the whites and the whites are going to be used um, in a diff the different way with the, for some different projects. Uh, I've got the vodka. It's not the particular brand, but don't get cheap because whatever is cheap is cheap. I'm gonna use a pinch of salt. I've got the pink Himalayan salt in here. What else? Um, that's icing sugar. What I that, that's not, you can use the icing sugar, but they have some anti-caking agents inside, etc, etc. So the best way is to buy the, just the granulated sugar and uh, and grind it in the coffee grinder or any other way in uh, some kind of Nutribullet or whatever, just to make it, to, to pulverize it, to, to make it like a, a very, very um fine powder you can use caster sugar that's about the cup like 150 grams of the powdered sugar i said the milk i've got the vanilla you can do that using the vanilla sugar or vanillin sugar whatever like a full full sachet of this vanillin or vanilla sugar i've got the real Madagascan vanilla, which I'm gonna grate on the grater during this process. And what? And I think that's it. Ah, so six to eight yolks. It depends on the size. The bigger yolk, the, the less you need, the, 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 the smaller number. Uh, 200, 150 milligram, 50 grams, 200 grams uh, of the of the milk, evaporated, no sugar, because we don't need that too sweet. Yolks, milk, powder, salt, vanilla, and vodka. In fact, in my country. We do that with the alcohol, which is 95 to 98% strong. This one is, uh, uh, wow, where is the voltage? The voltage is probably something like a 50, 45, doesn't matter, they're all the same. 
So I'll use something about 200 grams of that, 200 milliliters of that. Mm. If you want to, because I, I need that as a filling to my chocolates, I like them to be quite thick. Uh, if you want it as a liqueur to drink, to pour over your cakes, to put over your um, Christmas pudding, for any other purpose and the drink from a small glasses, you know, always drink responsible. I'm not selling alcohol, I'm not telling you how to do, uh, you know, just that's for everyone not over 18 or 16. I'm gonna make a chocolate from that. So, uh, yeah, let's get to work. First, we need to add the uh, yolks into a mixing bowl and we'll stir it or mix it for a few minutes just to make it smooth and evenly paste. And then we're gonna add some of the icing sugar. Uh, I recommend to use a spoon because otherwise when you do it this way as I do there will be a cloud of sweet powder so to avoid it do it using a, 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 a spoon now we mix that for a while just to uh, just to have a paste and after a while we add the remaining part of icing sugar and we let it steer, be steered for another several minutes just to mix it properly. Uh, yeah. In the meantime, I'm going to grate um, a bit of vanilla. It's a Madagascan vanilla, very tasty, very aromatic. Uh, it's juicy and soft, so there will be not much in the bowl after grating, gra grating. <laughs> so you see it's not much but such a tiny amount is enough to release a gorgeous gorgeous aroma and make our mixture our eggnog uh, just fantastic we chop it uh, the, as well that will change the texture a little bit now the condensed, evaporated, evaporated milk, uh, really cold, good refrigerated. You can use the um, condensed milk as well. It will have a thicker, con there will be a, the, the mixture will be a thicker. You can give the condensed milk and a bit less of sugar. And now we're gonna add some vodka. Ah, first a uh, pinch of salt with a decent pinch of salt because it will make the taste and aroma of our eggnog, our avocado, uh, you know, more, more tasty. Now about 200 cold vodka, 100 mix. And now when we add the vodka to this, egg yolks and sugars, etc., we have to do it very slowly um, because if we'll be doing this quick and rapidly, the mixture can set, the mixture can cease. So we're doing it really slowly and afterwards we'll have to give it a few more minutes of mixing to have all the stuff smooth, silky, tasty and strong. So let's have a go. Uh, I'm not supposed to taste it and repeat it and repeat it because I'll be dizzy in a moment. Mm -hmm. It's lovely. It's a... How to say it? It's silky. It's very light. 
it's not too sweet it's just just perfect and has that kick yeah it's absolutely fantastic what we have to do now uh, now we have to fill up some vessel that may be a bottle that may be a jar that may be a jug whatever you want but the, the most important thing for now is to leave it in the fridge for at least 48 hours it's not easy it's not easy to stand it's not easy to wait but during this 48 hours i hope i will make no mis no mistake during the 48 hours that will settle down that will get the thickness and that will be just perfect for a uh, instant consumption there's no use by date because it, even if that would be a short one that never lasts that long whoever did that on your own will always drink it quick and the family believe me if they just find out that something like that is in your disposition they'll be circling like a vultures just to drink it well uh, I'm not manufacturing it but if you want me to share some of that gorgeous liquid with you just go down to a comment section not the comment the description box and there will be a um, there will be a link to my website where I have all my products and you can just order it or whatever and I share with you some of my stock uh, so like share subscribe and make it on your own or go to my website and the next in the next video I show you how to make uh, alcohol filled chocolates and truffles all the best you take care Christmas be soon.